nothing but chaos over here at uh, Operation Breakthrough right now. They're starting to set up the fashion show that's going to go on right after this whole sneaker thing is over with. But it's been a good time so far. Hopefully, we're going to make some more sales. So here we go. Just to let y'all know real quick, what y'all know about these right here. Still got these joints right here. The classic Fragment Sakai joints from a few years back. And also still got all of these right here. All the adapts. Well, not all of them. At least a few colorways. Three different colorways. Nike Rack Delamay 55 and a few other things here and there. Check this shit out. What y'all know about them blue SB lobsters right there, y'all? Check them joints out. And also the orange joints. I wonder if these are my in half right here. Definitely need these in an eight and a half. Oh shit. Also got trophy room back door ones. <laughs> Ooh, look at that green lobster. Oh, shit. US nine and a half, y'all. Yet to see these in person, and these look hella gnarly. Now I'm on my Air Force right here. Quite a few sizes in these. God, I need these in eight and a half. Anybody out there looking to get rid of an eight and a half? You got the receipt to them? Let me know. Whole bunch. Old school basketball stuff. KDs right here. Man, these go hard. So much. And also got Kobe's up here, undefeated Kobe's right there. More KDs right here, and then some LeBrons up there. Also go pretty hard right here actually, I don't even know what are these Kyrie's? So I don't even know man, I'm probably getting this all wrong, sorry. Oh yeah, no KDs as well, shit. You got this silhouette all wrong, please don't judge me. To go with the draft, a bunch of Chiefs gear right here, it looks like signed as well. 229 for these, 139 for this one, 159. Even more little helmets, and I'm pretty sure it's signed as well. Also, this one right here, check it out. Tony SB 57, full size, 399. Got a mini helmet. A whole bunch of stuff for the Chiefs right here. Let's see what else they got over here. Ultimate mini signed as well. A whole bunch of Chief gear for the for the draft and whatnot. More helmets signed over there. Chiefs helmets signed right here as well, 399. And also that gold one right there. These are absolutely little stuffed dolls over here, or dolls in general. But this right here is pretty dope as well. Some of the Huff Dunks right here. Check them joints out, man. These go hard, I ain't even gonna lie. These go hard right here, y'all. Straight up. Body butter. God damn. Well, it's the last day of the draft. And I didn't fucking know that it was going to end so soon after Kicks and Couture. Uh, it's basically already over. I'm just trying to kind of walk up to the stage at least and see all of the, well, what's all that's left <laughs> really. But um, overall, I heard that the Raiders did a pretty awesome job this year. I mean, they a lot of people were amazed the way that they did uh, this draft. I heard we got some really good defense. I apologize if my voice is cracking, but um, I haven't had a drink since basically Kick Sick and Tour, which was literally like three or four hours ago. So probably going to stop somewhere to get a drink and probably head back home and shit. This was insanely fucking disappointing to know that this shit already ended 
Um, I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, the night's still popping off. I mean, people are still here and kind of, you know, at the bars and shit like that. Uh, probably still from all uh, the... Uh, I, I mean, I wonder if they're still going to do something probably here in a bit. I know there's like an after party for Kiss and Tour at like 10 o'clock. So um, I might stop by there. Uh, it's a mosaic, so I don't know if they'll let me in, but, um, I mean, I'm of age, but I said, but I don't know if they'll let me in to freely or not. I, I could have swore they said something at the event about, um, getting in for free for some shit, but it said right now, all I'm trying to do again is just get up to the fucking stage and maybe get, you know, a little bit of what's left of the whole fucking thing, so... Wish me luck. Hopefully I can see at least something. Well, this fucking sucks. Uh, yeah, they're taking the whole thing down. I don't know if you guys want to see real quick. Let me show y'all. So, if you remember from day one and day two, they had, like, the lights blaring above the World War I uh, monument. And now, they're basically all gone. Well, there it fucking goes and all this glory and shit. NFL Draft Day 3 in Kansas City is finally over. It's been over for I don't know how long, and I fucking missed it. Here, I'm going to try to get it. There we go. That's a lot better. But, yeah, there you guys go. God damn, I fucking missed it. All right, I'm heading out. I mean, that's so fucking sad that I could not make uh, the last day of the draft. I really was looking forward to it right after the event over there at uh, Operation Breakthrough, but it is what it is. We had a somewhat successful day. We were uh, we were able to sell two pairs. Um, I mean, something's better than nothing, you know what I mean? Pretty sure, actually, there was one vendor that I saw that was right across from us that literally sold nothing. I felt really bad. Um, and it just makes you wonder, like, you know, sometimes are those things really worth going or something like this? Because this was definitely a lot funner to do than really to go over there, you know? But it is what it is. Uh, I, I just wonder right now, like, I wonder, you know, what time this whole thing ended, but it is what it is. But anyways, congratulations to all those that uh, got picked. Hopefully you guys bring your all to the NFL and uh, have a good one. And uh, good luck, guys. One final glimpse real quick. One more taste of defeat before we head out, but, I mean, it looks so awesome. Like, there's literally nothing, like, I don't know if you kind of, no, you can't even really see shit, but... Yeah, no, there's basically nothing up at that hill over there with the monument and obviously nothing less to, nothing left over here really, just the lights, taking down the stage and stuff like that, so everything's basically done for. Ah, oh, that sucks. Heading back to the car now. Okay, so back in the car, now driving, but not gonna look at the camera. Um I kinda had to sit a little bit in the car before I started this last uh, vlogging piece because I am disappointed. I'm not gonna lie. I'm I'm pretty upset with myself the fact that I decided to go home, drop off all the sneakers, and then uh, fucking um, come back. Literally like a whole hour and a half. Basically, you know, like I I basically have an hour and 17 minutes from home to here exactly here uh, uh, at Union Station. So, um. I mean, I'm disappointed, but it is what it is. I mean, it, it I hopefully, you know, the draft does come back again because I didn't get to explore the gallery, didn't get to explore a few things that were there for entertainment purposes, you know, uh, the food, didn't get to open or at least like have a, a nice uh, alcoholic drink. So that fucking suck. That fucking sucks pretty, pretty hard. I'm not going to lie. I wanted basically the full experience, you know, I wanted the full experience, and again, the reason why I was not able to have that experience is simply because I had fucking, um, I had kicks and couture, uh, to deal with, I had to deal with that bullshit, and quite frankly, I mean, was it worth it? Yeah, I mean, we made some sales, can't really, you know, disregard that, so... Still very happy about that. I mean, we sold some sneakers at the last, uh, you know, two events. Kicks to Contour and Soul Swap. So, still pretty happy about that. But, I mean, like I, like I mentioned earlier, it makes you wonder, is it really all worth it to fucking, you know, um, is it, does it, is it really worth it to go to those whenever something major like this is going on? I don't know. 
I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I mean, it definitely felt, you know, really disappointing not to go on the last day, but it is what it is again, like I said. But either way, though, thank you very much for watching at least the three days, obviously the night before, then the two actual days that I went, and then the last day, I guess. You can kind of, not really, you can't really count it. I mean, it's just we basically went, came to day three for disappointment. That's all it was. But I heard the Raiders did good this time, so hopefully it actually sticks. Hopefully the Raiders actually, you know, do something with the players that they got. I heard they got some stupid-ass offensive players, which was ridiculous. I don't know why, because uh, we need a defense more than anything. But anyways, thank you, very much, very, thank you very much for watching. I'm tired as fuck. I've been driving so much today. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good night. Hope you guys enjoyed the draft content. Be safe out there. And uh, hopefully NFL, you guys bring it back to Casey because that was a lot of fun. But anyways, take care. Have a good one. Congratulations to all those that got picked at this motherfucking thing. Hopefully it all goes well uh, on the field for you guys. But anyways, have a good one. See you guys later. Peace. Not bad, man.